What's up guys, out of here, welcome back to another video on MLB 21 The Show, and today we're going over the most OP created player that you can ever have. A lot of people like to have a shortstop or a catcher or, you know, a position player, but I think the best way to go is a reliever, um, and I say reliever because of this. So, um, the reliever, you can have unlimited stamina, just uh, even as a reliever, so Taking a reliever spot, um, I think you get eight or nine. So you can start him if you would like, because as you as you'll see, my guy has over a hundred uh, stamina, and he can last the full game as a reliever. Um, and that's just one of the great reasons. But we'll get into the rest of it now. So right now I have the pager on him. I have that maxed out at diamond, and on on my guy I have velocity two, control three, velocity one. And control four so I got two controls three and four and I got velocity one and two that helps max out his obviously his velocity and his control as much as possible without taking too much away from other attributes looking in this card here you can kind of see everything now these aren't his actual uh, finish stats right so he's 99 stamina it's maxed out 92 hits per nine 96 K's um, 78 walks per nine, 85 home runs per nine. Pitching clutch is low. I don't really worry about that too much. Um, 92 control, 99 velocity, 95 break. So he's very, he throws very hard, very controlled, and it moves a lot, as you can see in the top right. Um, he throws a 12-6 curve, a forcing fastball, a circle change, which is the best pitch out of this whole uh, repertoire, sinker, and a cutter. Now he throws his fastball at 99, which is mainly hits 100, 101 uh, for the majority of the game. The cutter, 97, that gets up to about 99, and the sinker stays about that 95 range. Um, then I like to throw a 12-6 in there. It drops a lot. It's only at 84 miles an hour, so a 15 mile an hour difference compared to the fastball. But the real uh, change is the circle change. And as you can see, at 70 miles an hour, I've seen it get as low as 65 miles an hour. So if you throw a 99 or 100 mile an hour fastball and you throw that circle change right behind it, that is a 30 to 35 mile an hour difference. And that is what is game changing with this build. So let me go to the actual stats because those stats are just what it would be if you were to play in um, like Road to the Show or something like that. Um, as you can see here in the team real quick, this is just a uh, life series team. I'm grinding some of the missions right now for that. But as you can see, I can see them in my bullpen. For some reason, they still haven't fixed this. It doesn't show you the stats in this screen. So you have to actually go into, like you're going to play a CPU, which I actually am going to hop into a game. Um, we're going to play a home so I can pitch first. Polo grounds. All right, so again, this is what was another thing was I was talking about through um, putting your player as a reliever, right? You have the starting pitcher, 94 stamina, 89 stamina, 93, 85, 110, right? Look at my guy. as a, This is a reliever, remember, a reliever. 99 stamina. So this is his actual numbers here. 99 stamina, 99 velocity, 92 control, 95 break. We saw that. He has 90 home runs per nine, 83 walks per nine, 122 Ks per nine, and 105 hits per nine. Very, very nice card. We'll just hop into the game here. So I like to use him out of the pen um, a lot just to throw the opponents off when I play online. However, like I said, you can start him. I have started him before. Um, but you'll see how just how deadly his pitch repertoire is. Here. Diamond Dynasty so I'll skip to us batting. So is pitching. Ryan All right, so this is the fastball. As you can see, it goes 97 to a 101. Now here's the first Ryan. offering. And it just blazing. Blazing. Here for strike fast. One. And he's got to be more disciplined here. It's 0-2. Let's get it going, boys. Somebody's loose. Hitting you can see there, it went from 98, 99, and 100. So it was a this is Ryan the cutter, is which is very nice to throw inside the righties. Anthony Santander is at the plate now. He's it looks like it's going to hit the inside more. of the plate, but it just keeps, this evening, a nice keeps on moving inside. See, that's where that pitch landed there. 
again now still inside uh, great pitch there and looks like it's gonna hit the inside of the plate so people swing but nobody keeps moving and you have the sinker the sinker so i don't really Trey this is my least stone pitch i only throw it low inning, so i mean as you can see it's a lower better. 90s people Ball actually normally catch up to it um i only use it to pitch away right to drop off the plate like that to strike out right he's gone to the well with that pitch three that will have to press all right so I'll go through, I'm just going to bunt here, go through the next couple the pitches. Of the first. But also you can see my guy's stance. Um, I totally forgot about that. It is a, I think it's generic, 23 or something like that. Generic 23 or something like that. And it is a very nice windup. Another one I like to use is Darren O'Day. If you're pretty good at locating pitches on... Um, like pinpoint or meter, or not meter, uh, pure analog, because his lineup is pretty fast for Darren O'Day, but it works pretty well. But it's that sidearm action um, that is really that sidearm to some marine action that really throws people off. Um, also, I have my guy Lefty. I've been a righty all my life in real life. You know, I, know, I was a pitcher. And we just have a bunch of lefties in this game, so that's why I made our my creative player lefty. So I'm gonna use the circle change for this one. I'm gonna start off with a fastball, right? So look at how fast this fastball is. 100 miles an hour. Then I'm gonna the circle change. 70 miles per hour. 30 mile an hour. You can kind of see it just like, looks like it's going to float halfway in the zone and then just drop. And then, right, putting up, same putting spot, go fastball, 30 mile an hour faster. It's very, it throws a lot of people's timing off. It's, uh, it's a pretty crazy pitch. Here's a 12 6 curve. Kind of looks like the circle change, but just faster. Boy, so far early in right, this one, this is a lot, really well. a lot of dip, right? That looked like it was going to go inside really quick. corner, Keeping the ball down or not inside zone. corner, inside Take middle, this guy so far early on. Uh, middle end, so it drops all the way Looks underneath like the inside, in this one. Um, low and inside. Austin Hayes, Again. the next to bat. Blazing fastball. So 70 mile an hour. Change up. Cutter inside. Even though he was fooled in the box right there by that pitch, he was able to sinker, keep his hands like I said, back. Really not too much. You can actually sub the sinker back. out with um, a slider or a slurve or a sweeping curve, something like that, to get some more um, action going. Uh, East to west, instead of north and south like most of these pitchers are. Yeah, this guy this is the best build in my opinion. Um, his windup's nuts. It's kind of hard to see, especially online. It looks a little bit more different. Um, as you guys know, online pitches look more choppy um, than it does on offline. So these look, these pitches kind of still kind of look smooth, but online it is it is hard to see. It's very hard to see. You got people. Especially when you throw that circle change, you get people swinging as soon as they, as soon as you release the ball because they're ready for that 100 mile an hour fastball, and you're throwing a pitch 30 miles slower. So, very nice um, pitch repertoire, and I think the best build for your player. Let me check one last thing. Let me check the pitching motion. I believe that is appearance. Yep. Motions and styles, animations. Generic stretch two. Generic stretch two looks like that. So when I use, um, you can also, like I said, I'm not former. You can also use um, Darren O'Day. I really like, which is right here. But he has a very quick, very quick, quick pitching motion. So you have to get used to that. Um, but uh, for the most part, I love using Generic Stretch 2. Pretty nice to control, easy, and it's weird. Uh, online, people have a hard time picking it up. But that's the best uh, pitching uh, pitcher you can have. I think you guys should switch your ball player from a position player to a reliever like this. Come out and shut, ga shut kids out uh, as a starter or as out of the bullpen, right? Having trouble, you might give up a couple of runs, bring this guy in. You're good for the rest of the game. They won't hit it. It's pretty crazy. 
Um, me and my buddy have found this since the beginning. I we haven't seen we have, we both haven't played anybody online um, that has anything near this. So um, yeah, it's pretty awesome. If you guys enjoy, go ahead and like and subscribe. Um, tell me what, what kind of ball player you guys have. If you guys are gonna switch or whatever because of this video. Um, yeah, I'm out. Peace.